हेलो एवरी वन आई एम वेलकमिंग यू ऑल वन सेकेंड टू दिस चैनल सो इन टू डेज वीडियो वी विल सी हाउ टू ड्रॉप एनी मॉलिक्यूल ओवर अनदर सर्फेस सो फॉर दिस आई हैव टेकन वन मैगजीन सर्फेस सो हियर द मैगजीन आई हैव टेकन इज वी टू सी ओ टू सो आई एम ओपनिंग द पोस्कर फाइल ऑफ द सेम इन डेस्टा सॉफ्टवेयर सो हियर आई एम ओपनिंग एंड यू कैन सी दैट so uh, this is the kind of surface and if i will see it along different different plane so it will look like this and along this one it will look like this and here it is now along c so uh, now what we will do so before going ahead we have to first remove the extra boundary atoms so some atoms are showing out of the boundary so first we will remove that so for that i am going to edit then uh, bonds and uh, click on here and then press uh, do not search uh, search atoms beyond the boundary so i have clicked on this then apply and then press okay so here you can see that some extra atoms uh, are now uh, not present here they went with this uh, particular arrangement and next what we will do uh, we can go to this objects and here there is a option for boundary so here uh, the minimum is 0 and maximum is at 1 so along all the three directions so what we will do here we will little bit we will reduce this boundary so i am making from 1 to uh, 0.99 here so uh, so what we we will got by this i will tell here so after doing this click on apply then press okay now you see only four at uh, no only five atoms are here like the bigger red color ones are vanadium and the smaller ones are oxygen like this o o2 and this black color is carbon so now we are having only five atoms here so this way we can see so this is nothing but b2 CO2. Okay, now what we will make to make a surface? We have to uh, like we have to um, transform this uh, unit cell. So for this, I am going to here. Then edit data. Then unit cell. Then here is the transform. So here we can make this to uh, some larger uh, like we can multiply the same with this matrix with any value. So I am multiplying here with six. uh six just any random number i am multiplying here you can uh, multiply any number like the dimension you want you can multiply so now uh, yes then search atoms in the new unit cell and add atom as uh, add them as new sites then okay then apply then okay now you see there so what happens here so when i did along the three directions so it's appeared as three directions like you see along j direction also it is showing that uh, like uh, six of such 1 2 3 4 5 6 so uh, what we can do if we don't want the elongation along z axis we can simply uh, remove it so for that like i did this to show that if you want to replicate so don't do that along z axis so here what we will do we will make this z axis as 1 so 6 6 and 1 so then okay and same thing we have to do again apply then okay now you can see what is the difference so you see only one surface is here like the surface is only elongated along x and y direction not along z so z direction is completely empty as you can see here okay so now what we will do uh, so this is ready like our surface is here uh, you can see and uh, next we will go to edit then edit data then here in the page so you see there is option to import so whatever molecule you want to import over the like on the surface of that magazine you want to put on the surface of that magazine or any surface you want to put uh, uh, that sir that molecule uh, and then the coordinate files for that molecule we have to import via this so i am importing here so here the molecule that i have is s8 like the 
sulfur acid molecule so here the xyz pile i have then i am opening that and uh, here you can see that if i will click on apply then by default it will come to the zeroth position of this molecule you see that now it is at the zeroth position see here and why this there are two different different uh, axis like uh, this uh, coordinate jo axis are visible because one this one is for the mixing surface and this is for the polysulfide so uh, this way it is coming so now what we will do we have to change the position of this molecule to uh, take to take it up to a particular uh, position uh, over the surface so for that again we will go to the same thing like edit data and phase so here uh, like here i have to choose this one because this is our uh, like the extra molecule that we have added so here we can change the global coordinate uh, system so here i am ch uh, changing this zero value to 5 like just some random numbers i am adding so that we can see which direction we have to go to uh, take that molecule on the surface of this uh, and now you see by doing this and applying i got this molecule here you can see that molecule is here now if this is actually uh, like uh, below this layer if you want to make it above this layer so you have to increase this z axis uh, value so i am from 17 from 7 to 15 i am changing so now you see it is over that surface and it is very very close i think so we can make it uh, 16 and then apply so this way you can change your uh, position to uh, take this molecule uh, to any of the any of your preferred position um, where you want to put the extra molecule so this way you can change and uh, i am also doing this to 6 6 so that it can be on the center so this way you can change and okay okay now you see uh, this molecule is above this surface and this way you can edit any molecule you want so now the main part is how to save this like here both coordinate files uh, like both of these coordinates are here how to save this in a part in a single postcard so for that you have to go to file then uh, export data and here uh, the format you have to save as bas postcard okay so now th this is bas postcard i have selected then save so here the main part is coming so whatever coordinate you want you can save so uh, for this time i am saving it as co cartesian coordinate and here uh, the option is you see the output of current unit cell convert to primitive cell convert to wiggly reduced cell so there are so many other option the last option is showing output coordinates of all displayed atoms so this one we have to do because here the uh, there are two different different coordinate that means two different different molecule as it is considering a uh, two different different atoms so we have to save the or uh, save all the atomic positions so that's why i did the fourth option and then press okay and now we can see on our uh, folder that this is saved so this one i have saved now i am opening it you see that okay i can show you first the uh, initial postcard so you see this was the initial postcard and uh, this was the initial postcard here we are having b2 o c o2 that means only five atoms now how many atoms we should have because i did a uh, 6 cross 6 unit cell so uh, here i can show you that uh, total 188 atoms yeah because uh, 6 cross 6 into 5 so uh, then and s8 plus eight molecules of this so 180 from uh, from this layer and eight molecule eight atoms from the s8 molecule so uh, this way you can uh, like uh, see that whether you are getting the correct po correct postcard or not so here as a whole if i will add add this up so i will get 188 atoms okay so uh, and at the end you can see the four last eight atoms are uh, for this uh, s8 molecule 
सो दिस वे यू कैन पुट एनी मॉलिक्यूल ऑन योर सर्फेस एंड यू कैन मेक ए लार्जर सर्फेस ऑफ एनी काइंड ऑफ मैगजीन और एनी काइंड ऑफ सर्फेस यू वॉन्ट टू क्रिएट सो सो यार दिस मच टू सो यू टूडे एंड ऑल्सो इफ यू वॉन्ट आई कैन ऑल्सो डू वन थिंग आई कैन ऑल्सो ओपन द सेम फाइल विच वी हैव सेव नाउ सो आई एम ओपनिंग इट हियर ओनली सो दिस वन वी आर हैविंग वी हैव जस्ट सेव दिस एट इलेवन फोर्टी सिक्स एम टूडे सो ओपन इट नाउ यू कैन सी दिस इज द सेम मॉलिक्यूल वॉट वी आर वी हैव सेव्ड एंड हियर आर सम बॉन्ड्स आर फॉर्मिंग दिस इज ड्यू टू द बॉन्ड फॉर्मेशन क्राइटेरिया ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर सॉफ्टवेयर सो इफ यू डोंट वॉन्ट दिस बॉन्ड फॉर्मेशन यू कैन ऑल्सो इंक्रीज योर जेड एक्सिस फॉर दिस पर्टिकुलर आइटम सो दिस वे यू कैन अरेंज योर मॉलिक्यूल and uh, and now you see there is only one particular coordinate system is visible now after saving this as uh, uh, like how we have saved so yeah this much for today's tutorial and thank you bye bye